All right, folks. Got deer in the garden. Just making do farms here. North Florida, the Big Bend area. Come out. Got my mustard greens. Deer stopped right there. But all the way down. Ate my mustard greens up. They started on my rutabagas. Then went to my turnips. They left me a few turnips over here on this section as you can see they got the rutabagas ate them up over here on this other section they started on my cabbage collards they've grown back a little bit as you can see here about 14 feet in the row they've all nibbled it down and they've, they've come back this is a couple of weeks ago but I got me a system that I found in the garage in the little shed my grandfather left here it's called a scarecrow sprinkler and I put this is a six, two sixty foot rows here this is one end it covers with a 40 foot beam I think uh, 20 feet long maybe it's on the box I'll have to read it again this is the other section they haven't messed with my onions they're down here on the far end they started eating the mustard greens on this end so they ate all the rutabagas down here on this end and a few turnips were through here on this row on this end whether the scarecrow sprinklers or not, they ate them turnips. I went ahead and pulled some of them up and went ahead and got most of these on this side and salvaged them for myself and went ahead and ate them. But as you can see here, here's the turnip bro where the scarecrow, which is on this side, and the mustard greens and the cabbage collards are still thriving. This is how I've been keeping the deer out of my garden. This is the scarecrow sprinkler. The scarecrow sprinkler. I'm not sure where he bought it from. But I'm sure we could, Mr. Google could tell us. But it's got a sensitivity mode on it. I have it off right now. You reach back here and turn this little knob up to high it runs off the 9 volt battery and again this is in the north florida area so we don't have very hard freezes too many hard freezes uh, you know if you have the hard freeze your water line is going to freeze so it's obviously not going to work for you and during a hard freeze uh oh we got a visitor there's a little cry baby. Let's see if there's... There we go. She got us. And the deer. I saw tracks before it rained the other evening. I caught them right here. And you saw them running off back towards the woods over here. This thing has been working for me. Keeping them off my cabbage collards and the rest of my mustards and turnip greens. The scarecrow sprinkler, that's how I've been keeping deer out of my garden. Look out, <laughs> it's gonna get you. <laughs> Just making do farms, keeping deer out of my garden. I'll back at you later.